Whoa, what a place! There's got to be some valuables in here. Ooh, what's this? Ha <laughs> ha, the perfect crime. Oh no, run! What's going on down here? Don't worry, I've got your back, Dad! Let me turn off the alarm. We've been robbed! The jewelry! Phew, it's all still here. The gold, too. That was lucky. Huh? <laughs> it's all gone, Dad! My doll's clothes! He took them all! Sweetheart, I'm so sorry. Use this tissue. Hmm, I know how to fix this. For a quick fashion fix, cut the bottom from a balloon. Fold the balloon over and cut a small piece from side and the top. Open the balloon up. A new outfit for Dolly. You might need to help dress her, though. Next, cut the bottom from another balloon. It makes great leggings. Let's add a splash of color with a large balloon. Cut off the top and bottom. And slide it over the doll's legs. It makes a great skirt! She belongs on the catwalk! I got a new wardrobe for your dolls! Wow, daddy! They look amazing! They're so fashionable! <laughs> Hello! I love your dress! You look so pretty in your new clothes! Thanks for the cake! Remember to make a wish! Here goes! I hope they come true! And your dad has a gift for you both! Do I? Oh, right! Ugh, this is all I have. Are you kidding me? Sorry, kids. It's okay, mom. At least we have cake. Maybe we can do something. I saw this advertisement! But your beautiful hair… It's the only way. It'll grow back. It's for my babies. This isn't right. Thanks, honey. Don't worry, kids. It's okay. Presents? Happy birthday! This is the best birthday ever! Thanks! I wonder what it is! We're good parents. The look on their faces. It's all worth it. Wow, it's a 3D pen! And I got a doll! That's a great present. Thank you! You're both welcome. Let's go for a walk, Dolly! I have an idea. Use a 3D pen to draw out thin horizontal lines. Work your way down the paper until you have a shape like this. Then go around the edges of the shape. Once that's done, create smaller shapes just like these. Stick them together and you have a chair. Ideal for a doll. Maybe Dolly wants to sit down after her walk? That's so kind! Thank you! It's amazing! Now she can have some cake! You're the best brother ever! Wow, Dolly. Your hair is amazing. You're so beautiful. <gasps> Hang on. Say hello to the latest in doll technology. The highly interactive AI means you'll have a friend for life. Your old news, Dolly. Daddy, I want that! Please! Thanks, Daddy. This is gonna be amazing. I'm so excited. I can't wait to see it! Whoa! It's even better than I imagined! Activating startup procedure. Hello. Oh I'm RoboDoll3000. Wow! This is so cool! Come on, let's play! Look at this lovely hair! My hair is made from a synthetic polymer. Uh-oh. That's not good. Luckily, you're a robot and have no emotions. Uh… Come on! Try and catch me! But you gotta be quick! Chase and capture protocol initiated. Cannot move. Calculating alternative route. Mayday! I'm almost done. Wow, you look fabulous! Uh, if you say so. What do you think? Uh! This outfit's cute. What else? Oh, we need this. We'll definitely wear this. Excellent choice. Whoa! Let's do this! That's it! Just copy me! Brush it off! Nice, Robodoll! The robot! Old school! Look at all the likes! Hmm. Eeny, meeny, miny. No! My makeup bag will definitely fit in here. 
Um, isn't this thing supposed to have a bottom? Guess this backpack is out of the running. But I really need my hands free today. Okay, I have the best idea ever. Turn your favorite purses into backpacks. Simply put the strap over your neck, pull your arms through, and toss it back. So cute! I kind of like this color better anyway. Almost forgot the most important thing! Oops. Where is she? My hands are getting restless here. Nope. Don't know how to juggle. If she's not here in five minutes, I'm leaving. Hey! Over here, Amy! Sophia! Nothing like a bestie reunion. Ah! Don't make any sudden movements. That thing almost ripped my ear off! Looks like Amy's shirt took the brunt of it. Yikes. I wish I could help you there, Amy. Hey, you like fun accessories, right? Take my bandana! It's cute, but what do I do with it? Little scarves are great for turning unsightly holes into super trendy accents. After pulling the bandana through the rip, wrap it around your fingers. And pull the other side through the loop. It makes a bow, see? That shirt looks even cuter than it did before! Now let's move on to more important things. Like spilling about your hot date last night. You're home! I want to see everything you bought! This skirt will go with everything, right? I'll show you. See? It even goes with the shirt I'm wearing now. It looks so good on you, Sophia. Um, did you happen to buy a belt while you were out? Yikes! That isn't part of the look. You probably should have tried these on before buying them. But maybe I can fashion something. If you have bottoms that are too loose, pull the button through the closest belt loop. Then fasten it from there. You don't even need a belt. You really are one fashionable smart cookie, girl. Something tells me Amy will be borrowing this in the near future. Nothing's better than a brunch with your bestie. It's the perfect time to catch up on the week's best gossip. And Sophia seems to have most of the dirt today. But if you're not talking, you've got to do something with that mouth of yours. Without even realizing it, you'll completely stub your face. And there's nothing wrong with that. Geez, Amy, you sure were hungry, huh? Better let those pants out a little. So much better. Ready to go? I can't button my jeans back up. You okay, Amy? <laughs> what? You wouldn't mind if I snagged one of these, would you? If your belly needs a little breathing room, a hair tie can give your jeans a little more give. Pull it through the hole and fasten it back up. Ah, now I feel way better. Let's go get dessert. When did that Jessica girl start getting in shape? That booty's rock solid! Mine could really use some attention. Alright, let's do this. This is far from workout attire. Now we're talking! These steps will have these buns burning in no time. I am woman, hear me roar! Watch your step! Hello, glutes. How you doing? Sophia better have some buns of steel after all this. This second round is a lot harder than the first. Phew. This is rough. No! Oh. I don't think I'll ever move again. Must. Move. Body! Okay. 
to see if it was all worth it. Any change? Anything? Oh man! That was the hardest I worked out ever! Maybe I just need to take a different approach. Nobody has to know, right? If you need a little more muscle definition, stuffing your pants is way easier than squats. Don't forget the other side. That would look weird. Get in there, little guy. There we go. Hey, Miss Bootylicious. Jessica's butt has nothing on Sophia's derriere. Am I in a more green or pink place today? Definitely pink. If you need me, I'll be blow drying my hair, Sophia. I better hurry. I better smooth these wrinkles out really quick. I don't want to get to class looking like a slob. Where's all the steam? I plugged it in. It's not hot at all! <laughs> Sophia, we have to leave in five minutes! This stupid iron is broken! Hmm. Let's just use heat from somewhere else. If you find yourself about an iron, simply blow dry your slightly damp clothing. Yeah! Yep, that works. There we go. This thing will be wrinkle free in a matter of minutes. See? There they go. The more damp your fabric, the longer it'll take to dry. All done. Thanks for the brilliant idea, Amy. And just like that, these girls are ready to go. Take a regular shawl or pashmina and put it over your head. With both hands, pull both corners under your arms and in front of your chest. Tie them together in a knot, like so. Now here's the fun part. Take this knot and slide it over your head. Check it out! You've got a new funky vest to hide those unsightly pit stains. Take that, summer weather! Ever go from Netflix and chill to Netflix and clothing malfunction? Don't stress! You can fix this! Just take a pair of scissors and a pinch of creativity! It feels good being helpful, doesn't it? Place the torn pair of pants on the table in front of you. Fold them in half so one leg is on top of the other. Find the corner sticking out – that's the crotch of the pants that needs mending. By making this rip even bigger, you can now place your entire head through it. Now put your arms through what used to be the pant legs. They're now sleeves. Wow! They actually fit pretty nicely! And there you have it! A cute new crop top you can wear to work out in. Or lounge around and watch more Netflix. Hey, we don't judge! You've been looking forward to this party for weeks! Oh, hey girl! Wait a minute… She stole my look! Lucky for you, you have a creative mind to back you up. Slide that skirt up over your chest. Snag a belt, thin or thick, and cinch it to accentuate your waistline. Top it off with a cute denim jacket and voila! You've got an adorable party dress that no one else will have. Go on, give us a twirl. You know you want to. See? No need to fight. Here's to creativity. Cheers! Ever wake up like this? Oversleeping is the worst. Will you have time to get ready? Time to turn those PJs into a look. Slip the pants off and put both legs into one side. Now pull them up over your chest. Take the unused pant leg, scrunch it up, and slide your head through. Whoa! Super stylish for PJs, that's for sure. Ha! 
sucker. Add a cute pair of heels and a bag and you're all set. And the best dressed award goes to… At work, it's easy to get in the zone. You totally forgot about happy hour with the girls! Don't stress, take the straps off your cotton undershirt and slide them over your head to either side. Like so. That's it! Who knew going from daytime to nighttime could be so effortlessly chic? And it can be your little secret. Ooh, it's time to get dresses to go out. What to wear, what to wear. This? Nah, too warm. A sweater? Not quite right. Oh, I totally forgot I had these cut-off shorts from last summer. Super cute. Yep, we found a winner. Yep, they totally fit. Wait. Oh man, my entire butt is hanging out. These are a lot shorter than I remember. Try this. Squeeze some glue along the back side of the edge of the shorts. Snag some scraps of your favorite fabric — lace is a great choice — and press it firmly on the glue. Oops! Don't forget to wrap it around the front the same way. Glue, then press. Guys, what DIYs and crafts would you like us to make? Leave a comment below! Don't forget to give a thumbs up if you want to see more of our videos soon! Who knew a pair of old shorts could look so cute? Congrats! You avoided an embarrassing booty slip. Well done! Ah, <sighs> nothing like spending your afternoon watching the same sitcom you've seen a hundred times. Hey! Um, we have plans, remember? Get it together, Helly. Save time by wearing your oversized t-shirt in a new way. Slide your arms through the neck and down to your waist. Now tuck those pesky armholes in. Well, what do you know? Cute pockets! Seriously, easiest outfit change ever, right? Let's go! Tap the notification bell to know when there are new videos from our channel. Ah. Uh. The old coffee dribble on the white shirt situation. Yikes. Lucky for Helly, all hope's not lost. Check it out! Take a marker or pen and outline the stains. Seriously, stick with us here. Your clumsiness just turned into a fantasy coffee island. Pretty impressive. Is it just me or is this way cuter than the plain white t-shirt was before? There are all kinds of life hacks. But for us ladies, there are a whole mess of girly hacks out there that serve us way better. Well, when it comes to girly hacks, there's a thin line between subtle trickery and full-on ridiculousness. Ooh, see what I mean? Every girl knows that when it comes time to get ready, tackling your hair is one of the first challenges of the day. All right, let's get curling, shall we? Starting with the front? Good thinking, Amy. Hmm, I wonder if I should wear that new dress today. Whoa, looks like that electric current just did Amy's hair for her. Amy? Your hair is… 
okay, Amy. There's gotta be a way we can fix this. Think this old sock can help? Actually, yeah! First take a good chunk of hair and separate it from the rest. Now tie the sock to the midpoint of the desired strand. Make sure it's on tight. Now wrap the rest of the strand around the remaining hanging material. Easy, right? When you get to the bottom, tie it with an elastic. Once you've done both sides, your job is practically done. Now all that's left is to wait. It depends on how tight you want those curls, but about an hour should suffice. Okay, let's see the magic unfold, shall we? Um, is it just me, or are those sock curls just as fabulous as curling iron curls? Don't worry, Amy, I brought the Firex! Oh. Well, looks like hairstyling just got a whole lot easier. Right, ladies? Ugh, finally I can stop and have a quick snack. I'm famished! Let's see, I don't want pepper or salt. Ooh, spicy dressing, that'll work. Ah, right, here we go. Come on, get out of there! There's gotta be a little left. I only need a few drops! Maybe if I screw the cap off I can scrounge up a little, but… No! There's one last drop and it ends up on my white t-shirt? Really? Um, this room's occupied? This is a stain emergency, Lana! Maybe it'll come out with water? Oh, that didn't work. Yikes. Lana, what do I do? Shaving cream? It's worth a try, right? Next time you're faced with a dressing mishap, just put a big glob of shaving cream on it. Make sure to rub it into all the stain. Next, place it under a running faucet and rinse off the excess shaving cream. Be sure to rub out the stain firmly with your hands once the cream is off. Wow! It's actually working, see? If you need it to dry faster, run a blow dryer over it for a few minutes. Wow, Lily, if removing stains was a superpower, you'd be every girl's hero! Here's your shaving cream. My job is done here. Oh, hey, Lana! Lana? Your hair looks amazing! Pink is so your color. Yep, that's some real rocker chick hair. Way to go, Lana! Wow, why am I suddenly hating my boring brown hair? Ew. I got you, girl! Check out this super easy hair hack! Just spray some color on a brush, and boom! You're in for an exciting color explosion! Brace yourself, Lily! Here it comes! Whoa! Your hair's turning blue before our very eyes! Welcome to the fabulous hair club, Lily! There's something peaceful about methodically applying your makeup. Until your bestie butts in and wants to share your mirror, that is. Seriously, Lana? Ugh. Lily, haven't you ever heard that sharing is caring? Come on, girls, don't fight. There's gotta be a way to settle this. Oh, besties. Can't live with them, can't live without them. Don't pout, Lily. You can always put that angry energy into a prank. Yep, things are looking up already, aren't they? Lana wants to put on her makeup that badly, huh? Fine then. I'll give her some makeup to put on. Just a drop or two is all it takes. Okay, five or six drops. I got your foundation ready for you, Lana. Oh man, another breakout? Ugh, so annoying. I'll just cover it up with a layer of foundation. No big deal. Wait a second. That's not my shade! Let me guess. Did you have something to do with this, Lily? But maybe this can work for something else. Looks like someone's getting a surprise makeover. If you put a deeper shade of foundation lightly onto a brush, you can kiss your skin with some adorable freckles. Oh, that looks so pretty! I know, I look radiant, don't I? Looks like sometimes tricks really do turn into treats. Ow! Who left this sharp bobby pin on the couch like this? Ooh, that had to hurt. Ooh! Something just stabbed me right in the foot! I see you, you little sucker! Ow! Okay, I have a few short minutes to get myself together before class. Oh, can't forget these! Oh, I can use a little makeup touch-up. These lashes need some help. Let's see if my mascara's in here. Hmm, where is it? Yikes! Another evil bobby pin strikes again! Are these things conspiring against me or something? 
If you're a girl, there's no doubt you understand the plight of stray bobby pins. Seriously, empty any purse or backpack and you're likely to find an arsenal of bobby pins you'd completely forgotten about. See? Case in point. If only there was a way to keep them all together instead of just throwing them around everywhere. Oh, I forgot I had Tic Tacs. Wait a minute. I think I have a solution to my bobby pin debacle. Before you throw away an old mint dispenser like this one, consider repurposing it into a pin holder. Simply put those bad boys in there and you're all set. You can even bedazzle it while you're at it. Why not? Now whenever you need a quick pin, it'll be in here, not in the sole of your foot. Super cute, Lana. Okay, now I really need to get to class. But not without this handy little guy. Ain't she gorgeous? Wow, you look picture perfect, Lily. But a little contour action will really make things pop. Too bad this thick brush can't make sharp lines. Yeah, that thing's way too fluffy for a good contour. Hmm, maybe my pink brush would work better? Ooh, still too thick. Okay, maybe this smaller one will do the trick. Ugh, it's still too bushy a brush. I'm so frustrated. Don't freak, Lily. Let me show you a little trick. Happen to have any bobby pins like this lying around? Take one of your brushes that's too big and flatten it with your fingers. Then hold it in place with your bobby pin. Once that's in place, get a second bobby pin and crisscross them just like this. It should look a lot like the letter X. Why go buy a special contour brush when you can fashion one yourself? Wondering if it actually works? The proof is in the pudding, my friends. Wow, what a difference a brush makes, right? When it comes to hacks like this one, all it takes is some imagination and a touch of girly flair. Come on, Tasha. Time to come out. Your hair today is fantastic and on point. Hey, look what she's got! No way! Your doll is beautiful! I love her hair! What's her name? Oh, everyone's in love with her doll over there. Darla, I think we might need to do something with your hair. Wait! I know what we can do! Alright, I can't change my doll, but I can transform myself! I'll start with these green contacts. And now on to makeup! I'm gonna use this white pencil on my eyelids. I'll just dab it on, and then I'll use a brush to blend it. Next up, this bright pink! I'll use it on the outsides of my lids. Now for the glitter! The best! Just a little bit on the white. I'll need a good cat eye with my eyeliner. Can't forget the bottom either. Now for some more pink too. And of course, more glitter! There we go! Eyes are good, so time for the blender. Alright, that's enough for the blender. I'll do a touch of blush with my brush and then move on to brows. They've been shaped, so now I need to add some more color. Time for lips! Last step, false lashes. Did you think I was done? Nope. Got you! Two little white lines on my lips will look like highlights. And now, of course, I need hair. Hair is set. Now for some more makeup. I'll paint my hairline with this brown. And now for some more white lines. Yes! I'm done! And I look spectacular if I say so myself. She's just so lovely and… Oh my gosh! That's right. I'm back in class. Oh, wow, wow, wow! Look at her! You look just like her doll, but better! Sorry, Tasha. I'll see you later. Watch me do my doll dance! Alright. I think my ice cream table is finally ready to go. Ugh. Look at her over there. Huh? Is she glaring at me? Hey! Ice cream! Come and get it over here! Yes! Here's your ice cream cone! Thank you so much and enjoy! Ice cream! Fresh and delicious! Today only! Yes! My ice cream is a huge hit! One for you, and here for you, and you too! What? I can't believe she made so much money already! Hey! I have ice cream over here! It's delicious! Why doesn't anyone want to buy my ice cream? It's just as delicious! Wait! Maybe it's my look! Okay, I'll start with eye color. I think I'll go with blue. And now I'll use one of my ice cream cones. I traced the cone, and now I need paper napkins and liquid latex. I'll crumple the paper and dip it into the latex. 
Now I'll put it around the circle I drew. I want to make sure to do it around the whole circle. There we go. Done. Now to bring the cone back. And I'll just place the cone back into the spot I traced. Okay. I'll use this white pencil to trace a line down my face. All the way down to my lips and chin. Okay. That should be good enough. Now for this pink paint palette and brush. I'll dab it on the paper now that it's dried. I'll cover all the paper and then start painting my face too. Done! You know what's next? Sprinkles! I'll just sprinkle them over the cone and the paint. I'll also put them on my lips and my eyelid. And I'm done! It looks like I have a melted cone on my face! Time to get back to selling ice cream! Ice cream! I have ice cream available! Whoa! Look at her! That's where I'm gonna get my ice cream! Wow! Your makeup's amazing! Thanks! Here's your ice cream! Me too, please! I'd like a cone! Ooh! This ice cream is delicious! Ugh! What the heck? Well, I can do that too! There! See? What do you think about that? Gosh. I really wish I could meet an alien. I just gotta keep looking out there and see what I can find. Look at these amazing shoes I got! Sorry, I'm doing some science right now. Wait. I know what I can do to get your attention. All right. Time to start my makeup transformation. I'll start by drawing a line around my eye. And then I'll do the same with the other eye, too. Okay, that's good. Now for some black. I'll fill in the shapes that I drew with more black. Can't forget to cover my eyebrows, too. I don't need to do anything with my lids yet, though. Because for those spaces, I'll use a pencil instead of a brush. Next up, the green, of course. I'll just paint every other part of my skin with this color. Gotta do my lips, too. And of course my hair. Can't forget to make that green. I'll need a smaller brush to go along the black lines. And now I need this darker green for some contour lines. I'll have to blend it, too. Under my lip as well, for contour. I'll add some more on my lips right here. All right, time to add some yellow for contrast. I'll just dab it onto my cheekbones. Pretty much right around the black eyes I drew. And then I'll touch up my black lines and add a bit of white. Now if I close my eyes, I look like an alien. This is gonna be great! Hmm? What's that sound? Hmm, that's just one of my wall decals. <gasps> no way, no way, no way! Ah! Finally! I love you! You're amazing! All right, we've got to take a selfie! Wait, are you kidding me? This is just makeup? Ugh, I can't believe you're not a real alien! Well, I guess it's time to take off the makeup. Just wipe off all the green and black. It shouldn't take too long to get it all off. I know! I couldn't believe she said that to him! Yoink! I got it! <laughs> Keep away! Oops. Oh. We're gonna be in trouble. That is it! You know there's no running in the halls! I expect to see your parents in my office! Ugh, that's rough. I'm sorry I got you in trouble. Wait a second. I've got an idea! Time for another makeup transformation! I'll start by adding makeup in this area. It's watered-down glue that I'll have to dry. I'll put some in this area, too, while stretching my skin a bit. Then when it dries, my face looks wrinkled! Can't forget down here by my nose and mouth. Gotta do the other side, too. A blowout cheek. And that one's done, too. Now to focus on my eyelids. Ha! Look at how much older I look! But my lips still look youthful. Gotta get them, too. But now for my eyebrows. I'll shape them with some more glue to turn them gray. Gotta do my eyelashes, too. Now to do some blending. Last step, an old lady wig. What do you think? Do I look like a mom? Or more like a grandma? Hello, principal? Here's my grandma like you asked. <sighs> I see. Please take a seat. Have a seat right here, grandma. I'll just be outside. Hmm. You're her grandmother? You sent this home for me? Ah, uh, okay. Well, you see, she was running in the hallway. I understand. Say no more. I'll speak with her about following the rules. It totally worked! She bought it! Yes! Thank you! You're the bestest friend ever! Time to peel off my wrinkly face! Look at that! It's coming right off! 
Wait a second. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Run away! Hey, bro. That was such a great game. Right? I love playing one-on-one. -on -one. Back at ya. Let's play again. Oh, basketball. Fun. Can I play too? Uh, no way. This is guy's day. Well, what the heck? I thought you liked playing basketball. Guys are so dumb sometimes. Hmm, wait a second. What if I… Better take off these earrings to start. All right. Now time to remove all my makeup. Can't forget my lashes and eyes. Bye-bye, glitter. I like how clean my face feels after taking it all off. I'm a clean canvas and ready for a new look. I'll start by darkening my eyebrows, and then shaping them so they look thicker and wild. Now time to add some contour lines. But I'm doing them this way. And now to start blending it all in. Okay, it's eyelash tackling time. Just add a bit of foundation to them. And now I'll need just a little bit of this black color. Just a little dab so I can do small dots right here. I want to make it look like I've got some stubble. Just all across my jawline and chin. There. I'm done. Just need one more thing. The hat will hide my long hair. What do you think? Think they'll buy it? Do I look like one of the guys? I think this is one of my better transformations. They'll have to let me play now. Man, this ball is totally flat. Hey, bro. Wanna play? Nice job, bro. What do you think about this? I'm not a bro at all. You should have let me play earlier. Yeah. Okay, you're right. Let's play. This looks pretty cool, right? It's just my new awesome look. Or maybe it's just some clever makeup. Crawling out of your skin yet? Or is it just me? Don't worry. It doesn't really hurt. But it really transforms my face. And as long as it took to put on, it sure is a lot of fun taking it off. Well, we're about halfway done here. Lips and eyes are coming off. Ta-da! Back to me! Whoa! Now that's a twist! Hello? Ahem. Ugh, whatever. Hello? Come on in. You do magic spells, right? Well, what? Can you help me? A party? Says it's for unicorns only. I guess. One day you were human born, but now you're a creature with a horn! Cool! Wait, this doesn't feel real. Ugh, fine. Unicornius, turnius. Wait, what happened to my head? This is too much! So picky. Here, take this! What's special about this? Stay calm. Maybe makeup magic is more your style. Catch my drift? Now we're talking! And first, we've gotta play with texture a bit. At least on the forehead, anyway. Yep, we're making a horn, people! Here's where the magic really happens. It should stick right on it. And now it's time for the rest of the look. Some blue eyes will be cute! Easy, easy… Perfect! Now for the pink. Just brush it along the bottom of your brow. Then fill in the rest. Gotta make sure the rest matches. Contouring with pink is fabulous! Just make sure to blend. See how it all comes together? But don't forget about the lips! A fun blue hue is perfect! See? Uh, uh, Whoa! Now I'm a real unicorn goddess! All the little details bring it together. Every bit of sparkle counts. Time to get going! Whoa! Your makeup magic really worked! It's a real gift. Have fun at your little shindig. Bye! Toodles. Ah. Finally. I can start on my new book. What about me? <laughs> the story's sad. I could use some digital company. Nobody's even online? I feel so alone. Now what do I do? Oh. Check out this girl. How is she doing this to her hair? I want to look just like my doll! And it all starts with the brows. Don't forget to fill them all in. Then comes some shimmery shadow. Bring it all the way up to the lid. 
Blend it all. Then add some white to your waterline. Actually, a little thicker than that. Look at that gorgeous glow! Then add a brown to add dimension. Then blend, of course. See how nicely it goes together? But we're not done yet. Line that eye with a black liner. Then add a little bit on the bottom. Then add some lines going this way. See how they look like eyelashes? Time for a good old-fashioned contour. Now bring out that beauty blender. Keep going! Now add some rouge to your cheeks. Ta-da! Now line the lips, but not too harsh. Then blend in a nice rosy color. Mwah! Pull out the corners with this effect. Now's where you really start looking like a doll. Aw, so cute! All done! This living doll ought to get some attention! Oh, hello there! Shall we start streaming now? This will definitely be more fun to watch! Uh. More coffee, sweetheart? Cheryl? Is she asleep? Maybe she needs a little wind-up. Wakey-wakey! Oh! Thanks for the help! Now I can move! And look at all these people watching! Now we're talking! Wave hi! Ugh, could this get any less interesting? And that's why I call it the cotton candy brick! Sales are projected to soar by February! Are any of these people listening to me? Five out of ten? Ooh, uh, hmm. I know! Start by cutting the face in half. With a white makeup pencil. Then move on to the forehead. Now, fill in the top third with white makeup. This may take a couple of minutes. And perhaps more than one coat. Then move on to the bottom section. And now is where the fun starts! Here we go! The pink on one side, and the blue on the other. Yellow goes around the nose. And keep blending till you get to the neck. Great! Now put some white on a brush. And draw cute little clouds. They can be different sizes, too. Don't forget about the neck. A little gloss on the lips is great to finish it off. Isn't it pretty? You didn't think I'd leave the keys plain, did ya? Whoa! Those white contacts really make this a look! Now! Ahem! Can I continue? Whoa! You've gotta see this! Well done! Glad something got your attention. And now it's time to get a lot more. Bring it in! You've gotta taste it to believe it. Mmm! Sweeter than sweet! Huh? Awesome! Mom, look! And he was totally scared of me. Seriously, he's totally weird. Mm -hmm. I don't know about that. Aww. Yep, totally weird. Uh-huh. <gasps> There's Chris! Just look at all that gorgeous hair! So much hair! That was way too close for comfort! And I look like a total mess! This is so not good! Where's my makeup? Time for a transformation! A big one! Get your beauty blenders ready! It's foundation time! We want a nice thick layer today, followed by some shimmer. Close those lids, and sweep the brush all across. Don't be afraid to use plenty! Then comes the color. A little purple, perhaps? This'll definitely turn some heads. Just be sure to blend it well. And a little underneath won't hurt. Let's speed things up a bit. Just look at all that sparkle! But let's kick it up a notch. Ooh! Bring it on! My eyes are like disco balls now! Now how do you like that? 
Nothing like some eyeliner to polish it up! Now onto the rest of my face! Don't forget the forehead! Yep, more blending! We want that line smooth! The cheeks, too! And for the lips, glossy, obviously! And here's the final look! Kisses! <laughs> so crazy! Huh? Whoa! Since when does Cheryl look like that? What's up? <gasps> oh. Awkward. Hey! My face! Uh... I have the worst luck ever! <sighs> Are those for me? I thought they'd bring out your smile. Oh. I can work with this. I know, right? Hey, I gotta go. <laughs> Give your granny some love! Why are her kisses always so wet? <laughs> I've got some prezzies for my lily! Ta-da! Uh, thanks? How old are these? And? Oh! Isn't this adorable? <laughs> thanks, grandma. But I saved the best for last! Cute, huh? Now try it on! But I wanna make sure it fits you! Go on, I'll wait here. That's a good girl. It fits you beautifully, Lily! Do a little spin for me. I'm sure it's not my style. I look like my mom, don't you think? My bracelets! They ought to jazz this skirt up. Put the bracelets under the skirt. And wrap the rubber band around it. Do it a couple more times, and before you know it, you've got an adorable new skirt! Do you mind taking my pic? For Instagram? Where are the buttons on this thing? Ooh, am I holding it upright? Just hold still! <sighs> Is that David? What's up, ladies? <sighs> That's better. Wow! What's up, Lily? Bella? Looks like we've got a little situation on our hands. May the best woman win! I'm so winning this. Wow, that's a lot of weight! I'm just strong like that. You okay, Lily? Going down! Bella definitely won that round. And Bella's taking the lead again! Lily ought to start eating more spinach. And Bella's still in the lead. Whatever. Don't be a sore loser, Lily. And I still got more in me. How is this even fair? I can't do any of that stuff. That's it, folks! You win, Bella! But it came with a price. That's embarrassing. So gross! It's okay, Bella. Sweating's natural. I have an idea! Come on! See this regular t-shirt? Take scissors and cut it like this. Then go the opposite direction. In the end, it should look like this. Hello, muscle tea. See these? Tie them in a little knot like this. And then a bow. Pretty cute, right? My skin can actually breathe now. And it's stylish, too. All that nasty sweat's gone. 
Wish I could say the same. Bye -bye. See ya. <laughs> Someone needs his own muscle tea. Wow, this book is really a gem. Hey, who was about to talk to him? Looks like Bella really needs some books. Those look like the right ones. Careful, these are pretty heavy. They're due back next week. Thanks a lot. Seriously? I knew I wasn't cut out to be a bookworm. <laughs> this is a library, remember? Shh. I feel kind of bad. Hey, it'll be okay. Just leave me alone. I don't need your sympathy. Wait. I know exactly what to do. First, untie these laces. Then the pants. Are you kidding me? Oh boy. Cross the ankles. Then tie them together with the shoelace. Nice and tight. Then fold the legs back like this. And stick the extra laces in the belt loops. Pull it all the way through. Then turn the jeans over. And string the laces through the front loops. Put the books inside like this. Then tie them nice and tight. See? Now you have a makeshift backpack. It even has armholes. Hey, wow. it actually worked. This is pretty awesome. Uh, thanks, nerdy girl. See ya! Lipstick's pretty nice. Huh? The sales today? I'm coming! Yes! It's even better than I imagined! And everything's discounted. Wow, that was the fastest I've ever seen. Got it! This is so unfair! There's one item left, miss. It's cute, I guess. Fine, I'll try. Well, may as well see if it fits. The design is pretty cool. What? It's two sizes too big. I'm practically swimming in it. I need some reinforcements. Any belts out here? That clip. Just gonna take it for one second. This is exactly what I need. Just spread it apart, bunch the fabric, and use the pin to secure it. And now it fits perfectly. I think I'll wear it out of here. Just need some great pumps. Am I a fashion genius or what? Thanks for the awesome sale! Keep the change! Hey, wasn't I wearing a clip? That's super weird. This party is gonna be epic! Uh, Miss Bella, care to explain this pigsty? Don't worry about it. I'm more concerned about what to wear. Is this color good? It's a little too pink. But these could work. It's still a mess in here. You have way too many clothes. I'll be back. Whatever. Did you see Amy's outfit this morning? If she won't clean, I will. Hey! Mom, stop! I can't take this anymore! Uh-oh. I'll call you back. Serves you right. Oh, 
Oh man, my mom ruins everything! Unless… I can get creative with this. If you have bleach handy, pour it on just one pant leg. Don't be afraid to really glob it on. And now we wait. Look how unique these jeans are now! I'm back! Looks like the bleach looks good on those. My daughter's so crafty. How big can I make the next bubble? I think I need another piece. This should top my personal record! Okay, it's getting softer. But I'd better stretch it out a bit. Now it's almost big bubble time! Ooh! Oh, that's really bad. Should I tell Betty it's in her hair? No, I can just grab it. What? Uh, gum? No. Oh man, what do I do? Ah! Maybe she'll want to wear a wig. No, that's stupid. Honestly, there's only one way to fix this. But she's totally gonna notice! My coke! Think this could get the gum out? Put the bottle near the gum. Then stick the affected strand inside. Keep going till the gum is submerged. Pull it out. Then pick it out with your fingers. It worked! Was that close or what? Yikes! I gotta get to work! Mmm, these pickles smell so good! I wonder if they taste as fabulous. Ooh, that would be a yes! Hey! Look what my grandma gave me! How old is that? It used to be a lot sparklier. I can't wear this thing. It's gross. Bummer. It's okay, Bella. In fact, I know exactly what to do! Dare me to stick this in pickle juice? The brine should clear the silver up. Whoa! Now for a pinch of baking soda. And now for the real magic. Watch as the bubbles do the scrubbing. You'll know it's done once the bubbles clear. Looks like it's just about done. Stir it a bit. Then fish it on out. Hey, check it out! Isn't it beautiful? Wow! That's how I remembered it. I'll do the honors. It sure is shiny, huh? Check out this fabulosity. Thank you! You're the smartest friend I have. And the best cook. You should always start your morning with your favorite breakfast food. And for Betty, that's cornflakes. Oh, what a mess. See you next time, cereal! Scram, little flakes! Hey, any of that left for me? That looks pretty good. Come on! There! Oh no! This is simply unacceptable. Betty! Betty! Yeah? What happened? Do you know how to close a box? Let me show you how it's done. Take three tabs and fold them down. Then dent the side in like this. Do it 
it on the other side, too. Then tuck the last tab in like this. There! Now it's nice and secure. See? Spill-proof and then some. Well, that's… different. Here! Now you get to work. I have to get to class. Whatever you say, Bella. Good thing I bought milk yesterday. I just need one cup. And now we blend! A minute or two should be good. Is it supposed to splash like that? Watch the eyes! I'd be surprised if any was left in the bowl. It's like a strawberry cake facial! How could you betray me like this? I'm never baking again! There, I'm almost finished. Huh? Is that Bella? What's wrong? Actually, no words are necessary. How'd this happen? Gimme that. I think I have an idea. With a whisk and a pair of pliers, make your own mixing device. Once the prongs are pulled a bit, put hot glue on the tips. Make sure they're sizable globs. They're not going to attach to anything. Then let them dry. Dry those tears, Bella. You're damp enough as it is. Feel better now? A head massage should calm you down. It tickles a bit, but feels good, right? Hey, it's really working. Shower first, hug second. Hark! Tis the gentle sound of water droplets. Ah, nothing like a hot shower, right? Boy, did I need that. Now I have to put my hair in a towel. It's off to my beauty routine. Step one, brush those pearly whites. They say to use a pea-sized squeeze, but I say the more the better. Ah, <sighs> that's minty fresh. Wait! My towel! Ick. It's covered in old toothpaste. Wait! My hair elastic. I bet I can fashion something out of this. For this hack, fold the towel in half. Then grab some heavy-duty scissors and cut across it in a diagonal line. Set the right section aside. Then, with a thread and needle, stitch the two cut pieces together. Before you sew it closed completely, stick your elastic halfway in at the tip. Now finish your stitch to include this piece. Once done, snip off the excess thread. Now open it up like this and pull the elastic through. But you're not done yet. See this button? Sew it onto this corner. Be sure to sew it to one layer only. Very nice. Check out this masterpiece. Once it's on your head, just twist. And loop it around the button. Yes! It's movie night! And tonight we're watching The Notebook for the hundredth time. We just can't get enough of Ryan Gosling, can we, girls? Ooh, you got the good chips this time. Nice choice. We'll never get sick of this movie. 
Oh no, she can't remember who he is? No, he's your love, remember? Oh god, why are we doing this to ourselves? Again? Oh man, they both died holding hands. It's just so sweet. Why do I always think this movie's going to end differently every time I watch it? Whoop. Um, um, Vicky, help a sister out here? Oh, looks like I snagged you there. I'm sorry. Wait, I have an idea. I'm gonna just borrow your bobby pin for one second. If you have a snag in your sweater, loop the thread through a bobby pin just like this. Then stick the bobby pin back into the sweater and out through another opening. See? Looks like it never even happened. Here's a closer look. Put the thread in the pin, push it through, and push it through another opening. Snag be gone. Okay, I'm not mad anymore. Thanks. Whoa, Vicky, your makeup. <laughs> um, Helly, you should talk. Oh, man. Watching it again next weekend? Yup. Nothing can spoil a beautiful day outside in the fresh air, right? That is, until a greedy little thief steals your hard-earned cash oh. right out of your pocket. Helly, come on, turn around! Oh, man. There's gotta be a better way to hide your cash in your pocket. Here's a nifty hack. Take a regular old maxi pad and open it up. But don't take it out of the wrapper. Take a wad of cash and fold it up inside the pad, right in the middle. Now seal that sucker back up and watch the magic. Next time you're sitting outside, stick your makeshift wallet into your back pocket and you can rest assured, no one's gonna wanna yeah. steal an old pad. Ugh, nothing good is on. Stupid. Seen it already. <sighs> hey, Helly! Whoa! Jeez, Vicky, what did you do? Pop that button off with a slingshot? Oh, that's gotta hurt. Oh no, not our picture! Okay, seriously, will this thing slow down already? Whoa! Pineapple juice down! Don't sweat it, Vicky. I got you. Here, take this dime. No offense, Helly, but how on earth is spare change going to help fix Vicky's pants? Believe it or not, a metal coin like this can actually come in really handy. The next DIY clothing hack is a really clever one, so watch closely. All right, let's give this guy a try, shall we? Cut a piece of denim out of an old pair of jeans in the shape of a circle. Flip it over so that the back side is facing up. Place the dime in the center. With a needle and thread, start to make stitches around the dime. You can make the stitches fairly large, but not too big, see? Go all the way around. Go ahead and gently pull the string tight so that it puckers the fabric around the dime. Now wrap the rest of the thread around the tail multiple times so that it's nice and tight. Put the button into the first buttonhole so that the tail is facing inward. Turn it over and start to widen and flatten the tail fabric so it's pressed against the jeans. With your thread and needle, sew the tail down flat so that the button stays put. Snip off the remaining thread. Now take the other buttonhole and slip the new denim button through it. Hey, that looks pretty good. So if you're ever in a bind and don't have any spare buttons on you, spare change and some clever stitching can save the day. Another day, another work outfit. And while you like to keep things casual, a nice shirt tuck can take your outfit up a notch. A tuck in the back and a tuck in the front. Looking good, Helly. Now grab your bag and off you go! Oh shoot, my shoe's untied. Oh! Oh man, get back in there. Need to grab that box up there? And there goes your shirt again. Ugh, is there anything more annoying? Yep, I knew that would happen. Um, um, if I continue doing this all day, people are gonna start thinking I'm scratching my butt. If you are sick of tugging at your work shirt all day, this hack will knock your socks off. Grab a pair of scissors and cut across the bottom of the shirt before it starts to curve. Now get a pair of stretchy undies. Take the front of the waistband of the underwear and fold it down against the front of the work shirt like this. With a needle and thread, begin to stitch the two pieces together. 
With the second stitch, go back over the fabric to the other side so you can see the string looping over the edge. Once you've stitched the undies along the bottom of the shirt, do a couple loop arounds and knot off the end of the thread. Well, look at that! You just fashioned your very own leotard! Oop, you're not done yet! Make a cut across the crotch area. Take the front of the underwear flap and fold it upward. Place a small snap on the fabric and begin to sew it, starting from behind. Once you've done four of these, two on each flap, you'll see that they snap together. This part may have taken a while, but the snaps come in really handy when Mother Nature calls. Now when you put on your shirt, you don't even need to take the time to tuck the ends in. See? Now your shirt can lay perfectly flat with no awkward bunching. Go ahead and give it a tug test. I wonder how long it took her to put those fake eyelashes on. That's enough fashion news for today. Yikes! Oh man, I can't get off this couch, it's freezing! Oh, hey, what's this? Fuzzy socks? Now we're talking! <sighs> okay, now I feel way better. Whoever invented socks is a genius. No more ice for these toes! But if you really want to get smart with these, pull the fabric from your ankles over a pair of sandals like this. Now you have yourself a pair of fuzzy slippers. And back under the blanket you go. Stay cozy, Vicky! Ah, <sighs> toasty warm goodness. Packing for a trip there, Helly? All that stuff should fit into your backpack, right? It's just a short two-day trip, after all. Hmm, wait a minute. All right, come on, please fit. Maybe if I just keep shoving it in again and again, it'll all fit? I'm never gonna make it to my trip on time. Hey there, Helly. Packing trouble? Oh, jeez, it's like a monkey packed that thing. Let me show you a little packing hack my mom taught me that never fails to save space. Take this t-shirt and lay it flat on the table. Fold the sleeves in over the chest. Now take other items like your towel, underwear, and socks and lay them on top just like this. Lift up the top of the shirt with everything on top and roll it on down. Kind of like you're making a little burrito, filled with clothes instead of beans, of course. See the ankles on your socks sticking out of the sides? Pull them over the ends, securing the roll of clothes you've made. You can do it in one big cuff, see? Nice! Now you've got yourself a compact burrito buddy to take with you on your trip. Oh wow! They can fit right into my backpack no problem! And what's also great about this packing method is that your clothes won't be as wrinkled. Hurry up, we're late! I love painting. It's so peaceful and wonderful. Next, I'll use this light pink color. It's very pretty. Oh, looks like I'm getting a message. Let's see. Oh, a rainbow party? Get out of town! That's awesome! Okay, I gotta find something appropriate to wear. Oops, paintbrush. All right, wardrobe, what do you got for me? Ugh, this is not good. There's absolutely no color at all. Well, what the heck am I gonna do? I need to be rainbowy. Oh, wait! My paints! They're super colorful! I bet I can totally do something with them. I'm a genius! All right, time to get me rainbow-fied! Gonna need some paints and gonna need some paintbrushes. I can do both colors at once. Now to add these colors to my eyes. Time to switch up the colors and go underneath now. This is looking great. But it's a rainbow party. I need more colors. I'll need this bigger brush for this part, though. Okay, these colors are on this brush. Which is ready to paint. Here we go! Onto my lips it goes! Okay, next step is this green mascara! So fun! Gotta really make sure the color gets onto my lashes. Ooh, I know! I need some brow color! This orange! I can keep them both shaped, too. It's really coming along! There we go! Just a bit more! Done! And now for just a little bit more! Oh my gosh! These little blue freckles are adorable! I wish I always had these cute little blue freckles! Okay, and I'm finally done with my rainbow makeup! Huh? What's that? Look at all those lights! Whoa! It's the rainbow party! And it's tight! Whoa! Your makeup is amazing! Did you do it yourself? It's so fun! Great choice for a rainbow party! My water is hot enough now, so now I can have my soup! Ah, uh, I've been looking forward to this all day! 
Mmm, that's really good and comforting. Now, let's see what's on TV for me to watch. Mm, I'll try something else. Hey, y'all! Today I'm gonna show you my new home. Come with me. So this is my party room. It has a DJ 24 hours a day. Ooh, a DJ. I bet that's really fun. Huh? Ugh, my TV's acting up again. Come on! And this is my office with my new PC and my gaming wheel. That's right, I'm the best. When I need to relax from my busy day, I like to take a bath. Wow. Oh, ah, hot! And when I'm ready to go to bed, I just cover myself with my money. Man, I need to stop watching this. I wish my life was that decadent. Now I need to get clean since I'm covered in soup. I wish I had fun bath bombs that made bubbles. Just gotta scrub myself with this rough sponge. Oh man, and now I dropped my soap too. All right, where's my soap? There it is. Get back here. <sighs> I can't stop thinking about those colorful bath bombs. Wait a second, wait a second! I think I've got an idea! Okay, I'm gonna start with an empty bowl. And then some baking soda. I'll just pour some into the bowl. That should be enough. Now I need to add some citric acid, too. Next up, some coconut oil. That's always nice. Now time to whisk this all together with my trusty whisk. All of this powder is just kinda crumbling up a bit. There we go. I've got my big bowl and a bunch of little bowls, too. I also need some coloring, too. Because I want them to be pretty. Ooh, it's kinda hard to mix up. Gotta keep stirring. Time for a silicone tray. Can't forget about my big white bowl, either. It gets its own mold. I'll just scoop up the powder with this spoon into the mold. Okay, now I wanna add a little bit of the colors, too. And then I'll need to cover it up with more white powder. That's good. And now to pat it down some more. And I'll spritz the top with some antiseptic spray so it sets. There we go. Now I can take it out of the mold. All right. Now I'm ready to use my cloud bath bomb. And my bath bomb is even better because I made it myself. Time to dunk it! Ooh, here comes all the bubbles and fizz! Oh look! The rainbow colors are making an appearance! All these colors make me so happy! I'm so glad I spilled my soup now. What a great day! Hey! What the heck? Where are you? I'm sorry, I'm sorry! I'm totally on my way right now! Oh no. Look at all that color! I'm wearing all white! No way they're gonna let me in! Oh no. Oops. This is really bad. Wait, is that you over there? Hey, can you see me? I gotta do something and quick! Is there somewhere I can hide? Ugh, the trash can? This is the worst. But it's all I got. Alright, here I go. Right into the trash can. <laughs> oh, guess I was mistaken. Phew, that was a close one. She almost saw me. Ugh, it's so gross in here. Ow, what the heck? My art career is officially over. Huh? What's in here? No way! Glitter! Okay, I've got a plate, and now I need to pour some glitter on it. This red color is so pretty. I just need to make a line of it. Next up, some golden glitter. Just pouring it all out. Ooh, green for a third color is amazing. And then all the rest, too. Time to press my hand to all this glitter. Oh, look at that! So sparkly, so shiny! All right, let's get out of the trash can. Ugh. And now for my hands. Yeah! Some fun glasses will really complete this look. Time to get to this party! Especially since I'm already late. Babe! I'm so sorry it took me so long to get here! I can't believe you made me wait so long here! Yeah, but look at my shirt! I totally made this! Wait! You made that? No way! That's so impressive! Hey, we're ready to go into the party! Hmm. Let me take a look at you two. Alright, you're good. Well, I'm very excited to see what our contestants make. Oh, there's our first contestant with her dish! Okay, well, why don't you show us what you've cooked? Yes, okay. I've made my favorite dessert, banana fruity palooza. Uh, what the heck is that? As you can see, I especially focus on my plating. I wanted the color to be balanced with the shape of the food. Uh, it's mostly just fruit and candy. Here are your scores. Uh, excuse me? Are you kidding me with those scores? All right, next contestant, please. Hello, hello. Here I come with my dish. Nice to meet you. Well, I started my cooking journey in my youth. Oh, right. My dish, of course. Here it is. I have a marshmallow mint with a caramel reduction sauce. 
What? I can barely even see that from here. It's so small. Oh, he's still talking about it, too. Exhausting. What? How could those be my scores? Oh, this is really turning into a disappointing contest. Dory, I'm fine, everyone. But maybe you just didn't understand my dish. Ahem. Hi, I'm here for the contest. A child? Really? We're expected to compete against a youth? Okay, well, here's my food. Wow! It's a beautiful rainbow cake. It's absolutely stunning to behold. Rainbow frosting is easy to make. You just have to take your frosting colors and line them up on plastic wrap. However many colors you want in your rainbow, of course. There we go. I'll end with this pretty purple color. Now I'm gonna roll it up with plastic wrap. I want it to be nice and tight, but not so tight it mixes together. Once that's done, I can use some scissors to snip off this end. And then it's ready to put into the pastry bag for piping. All right, we're finally ready for the decorating stage. Here comes the rainbow frosting. Yes, it worked! And I love how pretty it looks on the edge. Just a little bit more, and there, the edge is done. Now I need to add some to the middle, too. This is a contest, after all, so I want to make sure it's nice and decorated. Ta-da! Here's my finished cake! Do you like it? How is it even possible that he created this? It's absurd! And here's your score! Yay! What? Are you kidding me? How is this even possible? <laughs> Just loop the lace over. And that's it! Thanks, mommy! Okay, let's give it a try. Stand up! Come on, sweetie! Whee! Wow! That's awesome! That's much better than my world of skates. Mm, it's not fair. Ready for bed, honey? Let's make you cozy. Okay, it's time to sleep. I'll just move these toys. Thanks, mommy! Uh… What's that? Is someone there? Oh no, it can't be! Is that… A monster?! Ah! Don't leave me! What are you doing? It's okay, you don't need to be scared of the dark. Hold on, I just need to clean this mess. Hmm, this tape might come in useful. I think I know how to fix this. I better get to work. Take a roll of tape and lay it flat. Put two strips of tape over the center of the roll. Just like this. Now start to draw on the tape, filling it in. Use different colors, creating sections. We want a rainbow effect. I'll put my phone right here and make sure the light is on. Wow! It's a night light! The monster won't get me now! Night, mommy! Phew. Oh, I'm getting tired, too. I need my beauty sleep. Ah, that feels good. Wait, what's that noise? Nope! I need my own night light. Now I can have sweet dreams. This is gonna be great! I love the pool! Mommy, I wanna go swimming! Oh, of course, sweetie. Let me get your water wings. Oh. Where are they? I thought I packed them. Uh, Olivia, go stand over there. Uh, why? Hmm. What about an oar? Mm, no way. Does cardboard float? That's a bad idea. Mommy? That's out. Let me think. Oh, I know. Don't move. Here's a pool donut. Hey, lady, that's mine. Find your own. I'm trying. At least there's a pool noodle. Hang on, I could use this. Cut a piece from the pool noodle, then use a knife to make slices. Do this all the way along the section. Repeat this with different colors. Now we need a zip tie. Thread the zip tie through the holes in two of the foam slices. Then tighten it. Use the zip ties to join the slices together. Cut off the excess plastic. Now you can go swimming! 
I feel so fashionable. Mommy, watch me! Cannonball! Look! I'm floating! This is amazing! Looking good, honey! And I can relax. Hey, that's cool. I want a vest too. Hurry, mommy! I'm coming! This is the best spot in the park! Mmm, I'm bored. Mommy, I wanna go play! Don't go far. I wanna see you, okay? Have fun! Woohoo! <laughs> Yuck! Good girl, Olivia. I'm really enjoying this book. Huh? Olivia? Well, where did she go? Olivia! Get back here! Oh no, this is bad. She can't have gone far. It'll be okay. Uh, don't panic. Olivia! Honey! Where are you? I've looked everywhere. <gasps> That's her hat! Olivia, get over here right now! No more silly games! Hey! Oh, I'm sorry! Give me my hat! I thought you were my daughter! Phew. Olivia! There you are! I've been looking for you! I was so worried! Don't do that again, okay? Balloons for sale! Only two dollars! Oh, that might be useful. That should do it. <laughs> the balloon's chasing me! Aw, she's so cute! And I can see her! Huh? Two balloons? Oh. Hi! Oh hey, great minds, huh? Hello? Hold on. Mommy has to do a meeting, Olivia, so be quiet. Got it! Ooh, that looks fun! Woohoo! What the… Shh! Huh? Oh, right. Sorry. Shall we continue? We were on the projected sales for the next month. The forecast is looking healthy. I, uh… Was that a flying shoe? Mommy, mommy! Who's that funny-looking man? Olivia! What did I tell you? This is so frustrating! Oh, I think I know what to do. Place a length of tape across a hula hoop, then another vertically. Keep applying tape across the hula hoop until you have something like this. Olivia, I have something for you. Look, it's a fun game. That should keep her busy. Let's try this again. So, where was I? I did it! I'm the best at this game! <laughs> hey, mommy! Ooh, yummy! What… what happened to your clothes? You're… you're so dirty! Me? What can you do? Stop! We need to clean you up. But mom, I'm hungry! I don't know how she does it. Aha! This'll do. I'll need to wash them later. At least I have one clean top. I have a clean top for you. Fine. But it's just gonna get messy. How is this even possible? Don't answer that. Put this on. Ugh. Do I have to? Mom, you're messing up my hair! Hurry, mommy! Thanks! That's better. Now eat your food. At last! Mmm, my favorite! Just look at the chocolatey goodness! No! Don't do it! I can't watch! It's okay. Oh, just breathe. Wait. This bag has given me an idea! Ooh, this is fancy! Mmm, it's so tasty! Ugh, it's on my hands! That's better! I could eat this all day! Well, I'm not cleaning your clothes. Okay, mom, I'm done! Let's take this off. I just need to tear the bag away. Lift your arms up. And you have nice, clean clothes. Now go and play! Bye, mommy! Bye, sweetie! Ah, there's nothing like freshly squeezed juice. Morning, mommy! 
Here's a nice glass of juice. Ugh! I don't want it! It's disgusting! It's good for you. I'd rather have some chocolate! No chocolate for breakfast! But… but… try and stop me! Give me that! Nah, nah! It's mine! Ugh, it's the same every morning. Hang on. Maybe I can use this poppet. This might be handy. I think this'll work. Take a poppet and pour some juice into it. Fill the bubbles completely. Place the poppet in the freezer until the juice is frozen, then remove it from the poppet. Wow, this looks great! Olivia will love it! I'd eat it! Olivia! What? Look what I've made. What is it? Try it. If you say so. It better be good! This is intense. Keep going. Please? It's nice! Phew! It's like a popsicle! Thanks, mommy! These are going in the trash. And they went to the dance together? Ouch! That's so sore! Ooh, that's a nasty cut. We need to clean the cut to stop infection. I know. I always carry a mini first aid kit. The cotton bud is filled with antiseptic. Snap the top. And the antiseptic flows to the cotton bud. That'll do. Ooh. Almost finished. There. All clean. That's so handy. Thanks. Come on. We have to go. No. I don't want to. Okay, sweetie. You sit there. Mommy just needs to put on her shoes. How do I look? My hair? It looks awful! I can't go out like this! No, please not now! I don't have time for this! What am I gonna do? That hat could be useful! I actually suit this color! The time! Quick! We have to go! Come on, sweetheart! Come with mommy! Look, mommy! Windy! My hat! My hair! Look what I found, mommy! Let's go! Not again! I can't do this all day! Back inside, honey. This is fun, mommy! I need to do something with my hair! But what? Those paper clips! And the elastic bands! But they're mine, mommy! Mommy is just borrowing them. Maybe if I… Then I could… That might work! Loop the elastic band around the paper clip. Clip them to the inside of the hat. Do the same on the other side. Put on the hat and loop the elastic bands around your ears. Now I'll just fix my hair and no one will know. This hat is staying on no matter the weather. Better take a jacket, sweetie. This looks so good. <gasps> We're still late. Let's get to the car. Works perfectly. Great party! I love this song! Ooh, cocktails! No way. There's a total hot guy over there. How cool is the straw? I must look great. Dance with him! Go! Oh, hey. Hi. I, uh, like your straw. Thanks. Dance with him! Woo! This song is great! Whoa! She has a forest under her arms! Where did he go? Uh, you got a little hair just there. Oh my gosh, this is so embarrassing! I think you need some deodorant, too. That candy is just what I need! Take a candle and a metal spoon. Light the candle and place the candy on the spoon. Wait for the candy to melt. Give it a stir, making sure it doesn't burn. Allow it to cool slightly. Apply to any unwanted hair. And there you have it! Homemade waxing strips! I'm back! The candy worked amazingly! Look. Smooth as a baby's butt. Yeah! Now where is that cutie? So the straw? It had bends in it. It was awesome! Boring. Who needs men anyway? Okay. Take out your books. School is so much fun! 
This is so boring. Okay, class, pay attention. Today's test is about the word zebra. I want you to write it out 20 times, okay? Here are your test papers. Miss, miss, I know how to write zebra. There you go. I want to see who is the quickest. Me, me! I love tests. Z-E-B-R-A, zebra. I wonder what the next test is. Hmm, Z. What's next? This is tricky. <laughs> You're so slow. This is so hard. Hmm, I think that's wrong. I'll take my time. This apple looks tasty. I can't do this. Hmm. This'll make it so much easier. Maybe if I use these pens and tape. Yeah, that'll do. Take a strip of tape. Place the pens along the tape. Just like this. Fold the tape over, securing the pens in place. Add some tape to the bottom of the pens. Now I can write much quicker. This saves so much time. Almost done. This apple is so crunchy. How are you doing, loser? No, that's not fair. Why am I eating this delicious apple? Quick, zebra, write! Uh, I think I'm finished. Miss, look, I did it. I'm first. Well, aren't you the clever one? Good work. But I'm faster. It's not fair. You can have your pens back now. I'm so thirsty. I need a drink. I'll quickly have this Coke and then get to class. I'll take it with me. Oh no, I can't take food or drink in. What am I gonna do? I'll need to put it in my bag. Wait a minute. Pencil. Soaking wet book. My book! My Coke! That is such a bad idea. What am I gonna do? Won't be needing this. Whoa! What a catch! That's my trash. Weird. Maybe I can use this bottle. This'll do. Take an empty bottle and cut off the top. Place the top of the bottle over a Coke can. A screw top Coke can that won't spill over my books. Better get to class. Don't want to be late. Time for my breakfast. What should I have? My favorite. Frosties. Hey, Nana. <gasps> oh! You almost frightened me to death. I'm old, you know. Sorry. Look at this mess. I didn't mean it. Guess I'll have to clean this up. Such a waste. I'm so sorry. Let me make it up to you. But how? I know. Fold the lid of the Frosties box over. Pinching it tight. There you go, Nana. No more spilled Frosties. Wonderful. Look at that. Let me try. A fold here. Pinch there. Did I do it right? You did! <laughs> now give me my chips! Not so fast! Nana needs to eat! A little drizzle of ketchup. Done! Hey, mom! Darling, hope you have a lovely day at school. I made you hot dogs for lunch. Oh, thanks, mom. Into the lunchbox they go. Uh, maybe if I turn it this way. Oh, it must fit. Uh, mom, maybe put the hot dog down. I can do this, sweetie. It's fine. I'll buy something at school. Stop! Get back here. I've made you a nice, nutritious meal, and you're taking it. Got it! Aha! This trash bag is ideal. Oh, don't be silly. The Ziploc bag will do. In you go, little doggy. There you go, darling. I'm not eating that. Why not? Oh, I get it. Lunch is ruined. Unless… This cake slicer will do the job. 
Warm the edge of the cake slicer with a lighter. Take a Ziploc bag and run the warm cake slicer down the middle, creating two sealed bags. Perfect for hot dogs! Bon appétit! Yummy! Thanks, Mom! Alright, class. Time to take a test. I'm gonna be collecting your cheat sheets. Alright, hand it over. Don't bother trying to hide it. <sighs> Alright, fine. Here it is. The teacher's headed over this way. Wait, I know what I should do. I need to hide my cheat sheet. I'll use my earring to pop open this spot on my cell phone. I've got this tiny little cheat sheet with the equations written on it. I'll just fold it up into an even tinier piece of paper. And now I can slide it right back into my phone so it's hidden. Alright, now I'm ready to finish this test with my phone at my side. Alright, hand over your phone. I need to check it out. You look good. Here you go. Okay, it looks like she's gone. Now I can open my phone back up. <laughs> I'm so clever. And now I have a cheat sheet I can use. I'm a total genius! So many trees in this forest… Oh! What time is it? Oh my! Let's see. Is everyone ready to start class? Uh, it doesn't look like it. Alright, time to get this started. I've got compasses here for you to use! I need you to draw a circle to match the ones on the board. Alright, come on up here and take one. Let's get to work! Aw, man. I can't believe we have to do work in class now. Everyone just take one and do what I said. Hey, wait! There isn't one left for me! Huh? What the heck? She went back to sleep? Now what am I supposed to do? This is kind of the worst. What's even the solution here? How am I supposed to draw a circle now? All I've got for tools that I can use is this ruler. I don't get this. How does this work? This stupid thing doesn't work at all! I can't draw a circle with it. What the heck? Jake has one and he doesn't even know what he's doing! This is so frustrating! This thing is such a pain to use! Ugh, I hate this. Wow, she's struggling too. Hey, I know what to do! I'll just open it up and there we go! Nailed it! Okay, maybe I can make something work with this ruler, though. Maybe I can just trace with it. Oh. Nope. That didn't work at all. Maybe I can just do it without the ruler at all! This isn't working! Come on, ruler, I need your help! Huh. I think I know what to do! Let me mark every two inches on this ruler. All the way down to the end. Great! So now I want to punch a little hole through each of those dots. Perfect! We're ready to give this a try! I'll set the ruler down and then put a pencil in the middle hole. And it's time to twist it! I'll just skip over my arm right here and finish the drawing. Done! It totally worked! Oh my goodness, you did draw a perfect circle! Wait, you brought me a compass to use now? That figures. Ugh, this is the worst. I hate studying this. I don't even understand some of these equations. Ugh, I give up! I'm just no good at this! Ugh, what the heck is that? Um, it's a stuffed toy. For you. You wanna play with me? I'm sorry, I can't. I have to do all this studying and homework to finish. I wish I could just go to bed, though. I'm so tired. Oh, oops. Oh. Oops. I nodded off. I just need to get some of this done. Ugh. Huh? What's going on? Where am I? This is the worst test I've ever seen! I fell asleep while studying! I'm gonna fail my test! Huh? Morning! You like my balloon? Huh? You wanna play with me? See? I added a ribbon to my balloon so it doesn't get away! But hey, maybe I can do something with this. I've got a balloon and now I need this marker. I'll draw on the equations. Now I can just deflate the balloon. Good, it's miniature now. I can put a piece of tape over it. I'll hold the balloon carefully, and now I can take the piece of tape off. Finally, I can put this piece of tape on my fingernail. It's pretty much a perfect fit. Alright, let's try and pass this math test with my nifty equations. No one's even noticed either. I'm so smart! Hmm. <laughs> let me see if she's cheating at all. Any cheat sheets? Alright, let me get a closer look. I'm gonna need my flashlight. Hey. Face me and open your mouth wide. All right, you're fine. Good job on not cheating. Phew. That was a close one. But I'm the best! And there we go. All right, class. Isn't this new powder just the absolute best? It lasts all day. Come on, let's take a selfie together. They're not even paying attention to me at all! Ahem! Essie! Cheryl! That is it! Separate from each other right now! No! I don't want you to go! Aww. I'm gonna miss you so much, Cheryl! 
We're so close and yet so far away! That's right. This is a class for learning. Psst, psst. What? What is it? We can use our phones and just talk to each other that way! Oh, okay. That's super smart. Let me get mine out. Stop right there. You think I was born yesterday? No phone for you. <laughs> Your phone too. I'm taking it with me. That's right. You can have them back after class. Now get back to work! But I'm keeping an eye on you. Okay, let me try this. Gonna bunch this up. Cheryl, this is for you! Oh no! It landed too far away! Did she see anything? Oh, looks like she's reading her book. Phew. We got lucky. Okay, I need to try something else now. I've got this plastic cup. I'll turn it upside down and then cut out the bottom. Then I'll need a balloon. I'm gonna snip off the end of the balloon like this. Now I can open it up and slide it over the cup. Excellent! Now I'm ready to try my little message cannon! I'll stick the message in, pull back the balloon, and then let it go! Whoa! Is this a message for me? Let me open and see! How are you? Aw, she sent a message just for me! Yes! It totally worked! Oh, I guess this is a message back from her. I wonder what it says. See you at the principal? I know how to make a message cannon, too! <laughs> I'm trying to reach! It's not my fault I'm too short to solve this problem! I need to get my pencil case! Man, I hate being this short. I can't reach anything! Ugh, can't they see I'm trying to read right here? Okay, there she is. Hi, Essie! Oh, hi. How are things with you? Oh. Oh, wow. You're really, really tall. Hi up there! Well, I just like you so much. Would it be okay if I kissed you? <sighs> Hey! Can you go a little faster? Ugh. Come on, I'm down here! All right, I need this megaphone. You need to lean down further to kiss me! Maybe I need to break out a ukulele song. <sighs> None of this is working. Wait a second. There are colored pencils over here. I can make this work. Uh -huh. I'm also gonna need a flip-flop. I'll remove the straps. I'll need to use some hot glue. I'll just put a little dab. Now I can stick a pencil right on the bit of the glue. And repeat. Okay, I fill the bottom. Now I'll add one in the middle on the top. And I can just twist this new strap and loop it around. Ta-da! Now these are some killer platform sandals. Let's slip these on and see if they work. Yes! Now to get closer to the smooch I'm waiting on. Wait. Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. It hasn't been that long. Hey, wake up! Uh, whatever. Let's just forget the whole thing. Huh? What? I'm awake. All right, the kissing. Here I come. <sighs> okay, I guess I'm still up for smooching you. Come on, we have to put our names down! Hey, wait! I wanna write mine down first! This is my space! This is my space! Get out of my way! Ugh, whatever. No one's gonna vote for you anyway. Nah, nah. Ooh! Nominations for prom queen! Come on, sign up with me! Okay, fine. Let's go. What if one of us gets crowned prom queen? Okay, let me just get out my pen. Here it is! I'm ready to sign! Ugh, what the heck? Shoot! This pen isn't working! Hmm. Oh wait! I've got an idea! I've got a banana in my bag! Wait. <laughs> that's not what I wanted. Let me try again. Here we go. I've got it this time! Yes! Oh wait. This is definitely not what I was looking for. Wow, no offense, but this is kind of taking a while. No, I know. I totally watched that episode last night, too. What the heck was that? Alright, that's it. I'm dumping my whole bag onto the ground. Wait, is that another container of juice? Hey! Actually, I think this has given me a great idea! All right, I'm gonna take this empty juice container and give it a little chop. Now I can remove that top and grab scissors so I can cut along the corner. I'm gonna wanna go all the way to the other end of the box. Then repeat with the other corners so I can open it up like this. I don't want it to look like a juice box, though, so I'll cover it with this pink paper. Time to flip it over and break out the glue stick. I wanna coat pretty much this whole space with the glue. Because I want to add this strip of orange paper to it now. Now it's time for the heavy-duty hot glue! Cause a glue stick won't cut it! I'm gonna add another one, but rotate it like this. Time to add even more hot glue, but this time on the ends. It doesn't have to be a lot. I'm just attaching this little piece of elastic. And then on this one, I'll glue down some magnet strips. Ta-da! I made a pencil and supplies holder! The elastic can hold markers and stuff, and some post-it notes can go up here. The magnets can even hold paper clips. Then when it's all filled, I can just fold it back up. The inside box has to be folded first. And then you can do the outside one. And now I can add the lid back on that I chopped off before! Hey! Look what I made for you! Hmm. What's this? I should open it? Okay. Whoa! No way! See? 
Now you can easily find something to write with. And now I can sign up to be prom queen. There! Aw, look at all the attention she's getting! No way! This is the coolest school supply holder I've ever seen! What are you doing? I'm taking a photo, look! Oh! Nice! What's taking so long? My hair is sitting perfect, hurry up! <laughs> it's just awful! My lunch was stuck in my braces! My mom can't hang this on the wall! That's why you've got to brush often! I need my teeth to be sparkling! The perfect Hollywood smile! Like I care about picture day. Who am I kidding? <laughs> I just wanted to be pretty! Hold me! <laughs> Do I know you? It's okay. I don't like smiling. It looks so bad. Thanks. I needed this. Did you just use my sweater as a hanky? Seriously? So gross. You're next. Come on. It's just a photograph. Ooh, that looks good. Hey, get your own ramen. What? No, I want your spoon. Thanks. Who needs a spoon? I don't have all day. Why do you have a spoon? That's an expensive looking camera. But it needs an upgrade. Place a series of rubber bands around the lens. Next, insert the spoon into the rubber bands. Be careful not to damage the camera. Place two more spoons on the sides of the lens. You're ready for your close-up. What? This is awesome! Just make sure to get my good side. That is good ramen. It worked just like I planned. You can have your spoon back. Uh, okay. Mmm. Oh, there's Madison. Mmm. Yes! It's still standing! She has no idea I'm here. I have a plan. What a pretty rock! Nice and quiet. Boo! Ah! No! My sunglasses! Why did you do that? Oops. I'll get them. So close! Wait. Are you seeing this? I need your phone. This is gonna look great! That's it! Keep going! What do you think? Wow! So creative! Look over there! Are you thinking what I'm thinking? This book is a real page-turner! Madison, check this out! I've got so many likes! That's impressive! Ugh, I'm so jealous! I'll show her. Where is she going? Hey! Hmm, I wonder what's wrong. I feel like an idiot, but this will be epic. Wow. What is she doing? Check these moves! So desperate. <sighs> Gotta get more likes! This has to work, right? Please stop. Admit it. You're impressed. Can I look? Oh! It's viral! Now leave me alone. Hmm. I need to see this. Stop it! Ouch! The perfect crime. Let's see what numbers she has. Zero? Really? What are you doing? Give me that! I need to get views, but how? Oh, I've got it! I need my iPad and a glass. I'll just run a firework clip and film through the glass. That should do it! Look at this! Whoa, now that's viral! Let's create something together! This is much more fun! So glad we're catching up! A delivery? For me? Okay. 
roses? Thank you! Oh my gosh! I have a secret admirer! That's so exciting! It's so romantic! Take a photograph! Smile! How do I look? That's it! Stay there! What do you think? Mm, they're not that good. Uh, okay. Let me try again. I'll strike some poses. You're a natural! Okay, these should be better. Mm, nope. Fine. Third time lucky. Oh, I saw this in a magazine. That's enough. Happy? Sorry, but no. Seriously? Oh, I should get paid for this. The camera loves me. Don't say it! Nah. Okay. I get it. That's it! Give me those flowers! Take a picture of this! Madison! Oh, sorry! The photo? Oh! Let me try something. This is a good spot. Okay, go for it! Is this okay? Wow! What a great idea! I love it! Thanks, bestie! Woohoo! Let's get a group picture! Selfie! <laughs> We're kind of busy. I'm playing a game! Come on, guys! Ugh. Excuse me! Make room! This way! Oh, this is good! Hey! Let's go! What's going on? Smile! Is everyone in? Squeeze together! Maybe if I move this way. Crouch down! I'm not in it! Ugh, I'm bored with this. It's ridiculous. Guys? What's wrong? Come back! I almost had it! Whoa, that's bright! Oh, I forgot something. I'll leave the mirror here. That's just what I need! I'm just borrowing it! Guys, get back here! Not again! Hold this! Ready? Everybody smile! Looking good! There's so many interesting things here! Ooh, look at that! Oh, we've been walking forever! I'm so bored. Wow, fascinating! Hey, Madison! Great, right, let's go! Okay! Look over there! What is it? It's stunning! Oh yeah, that's it! I need new friends. These will look awesome! It's about getting the perfect angle. How many photos are you taking? How are they looking? Terrible! Maybe I can help. With this. I need your phone. I'll pour a little water on the ground. That should do it. Next, I'll hold the phone over the puddle and take the picture. I think you'll like it. Whoa! You should be a professional! It is pretty good. Let's go! Hey, guys. Let's give you a new hairstyle, Naomi. Oh, I'm getting dizzy. Once your hair is twisted, I'll lower it into a bun. Okay, you can stop. Phew. Now we just need to put it in place. That's it. Quick, easy, and looks great. Ugh, I hate cleaning. Why does everything have to be so dusty? This is taking forever. There must be an easier way to mop floors. Ugh, ugh my hair is going everywhere. Ugh. The curse of having long hair. I can't even see what I'm doing. Ugh. I need to get a maid. Or a cleaning robot. Uh oh Hey! Uh, give it back! Stop eating my hair! Let go! Okay, that's it. 
I need to do something about this. Oh, scissors! Just what I need! You asked for this! <sighs> Wait. Maybe I shouldn't do this. I could use these hairbands instead. This seems like a better idea. I'll separate two strands from the front of my hair. Then tie them together under my chin. Just like this. I need another hairband. Now I need to separate this strand of hair. And tie it to another one. I'll put this hairband a little lower than the first one. This is looking good. I'll do the same with the other side. I want to create a lattice effect. Hmm. Now I know what I'd look like with a beard. Okay, it's almost finished. I'll tie my hair at the bottom. I just need to make sure it's secure. I'm so glad I thought of this instead of cutting my hair. But I have one more thing to do. I'll flip it over my head. Wow! It's perfect! My hair won't get in the way now. I guess it's back to cleaning. 